Along Harrison Avenue this morning, over 100 people marched from Bay High School to McKenzie Park, commemorating Juneteenth. People came from across the Panhandle to join the event, which even included Panama City officials. As News 13's Erica Orsted tells us, marchers say they're trying to send the message that we're 850 stronger together. With everything going on in the world right now, it's time to bring our community together. Panama City resident Chandler Strong says it's more than a march. I believe that Panama City can be the foundation of change for America. As dozens of people send a message. A lot of good things have happened, but we want to keep that momentum going. We have to come together. We have to unify if we want to see meaningful change. Freeport resident Xavier McGill came back to his hometown here in Panama City to support the movement, as did many others. Huge crowd out here this morning. Really shocked. I didn't expect to see this many folks out here. It really warmed my heart. It did. It almost moved me to tears. It really did. Marchers finished the walk at McKenzie Park, where speakers drove home their main point. We can definitely be that change. We can definitely set that tone, and I, and I think if we can just come together and set that tone, the world can hear it, and the nation can hear it as well. He says the change includes more accountability with law enforcement, starting with more open conversations. Let's sit down. Let's have the dialogue with the law enforcement. You know, let them know what's going on. Let them know what we expect of them, our city leaders. We need to see what we expect of them and, and what they expect of us as well. Strong says Hurricane Michael taught some valuable lessons that should be applied now. When Hurricane Michael hit, it destroyed a lot, but at the same time, it brought us together. And so I feel like the way we came together during Hurricane Michael, we should be able to come together all the time. Coming together for justice and unity through every protest and every footstep. We'll make a change one day by one. In Panama City, Erica Orstad, News 13, Panhandle Strong.